This is a Minecraft science video. You'll notice in the bottom left that I'm in Minecraft 1.7.2. We're going to be testing some mob spawning behavior. I am going to create a new world called Test Mob Spawning 1.7.2. In creative mode, I'm going to go into more world options and I'm going to make a super flat world and I'm going to customize it. And it's okay if you don't understand the syntax here, but 31 is a dead bush, tall grass block. And I'm going to say use that preset, generate structures off, and we're going to create a new world. And this will create a normal super flat world, except for it is covered in dead bushes on the top. And I'm in creative mode and I can fly all around. And something you will notice if I do time set 18,000 to make it the middle of the night, is that even though we are in difficulty normal, there are no mobs spawning anywhere. And the reason is the mob spawning algorithm that you can find by looking on the wiki says that the mob spawning algorithm starts with an air block and then will try to spawn mobs at the same Y coordinate uh, onto an opaque block, which means mobs can spawn inside of tall shrubs and different things. Um, but there needs to be an air block to start, and there aren't any air blocks right above the opaque blocks. All of the would-be air blocks are covered with shrubbery. And so if I knock out some of that shrubbery, say by taking a water bucket and putting it here, and then I move far enough away, then we should see some mobs start to spawn. And sure enough, there they go. And so the mob spawning algorithm required an air block at the same Y coordinate as the blocks that the mobs are going to spawn on. Note, for example, these zombies did spawn inside the shrubs, but they weren't able to spawn until there was a nearby air block at the same Y coordinate. And that's what the wiki has always said, and that's how I always thought mob spawning worked. However, let's try the same test again in Minecraft 1.8. So now here I am in Minecraft 1.8, and once again, I am going to create a new world. I'll call it test mob spawning 1.8. I will put it in creative mode. I will go and make a super flat world with presets. We no longer use ID numbers, and now we use the block names. And so now this is going to be Minecraft colon tall grass. But it'll be the same preset. I'm done. Generate structures off. Create new world. And you'll immediately notice a difference compared to 1.7. Uh, so here's my world. And look, slimes are starting to spawn already. And sure enough, if I do time set 18,000 to make it the middle of the night, then you'll see mobs start spawning everywhere, even though there aren't any air blocks above uh, the blocks that the mobs had spawned on. And this is true for like friendly mobs as well. We've got some pigs spawning over there. And this is something that I actually haven't tried before making this video. I just discovered this like 10 minutes ago, and I was so excited, I decided I would make a video about it. I don't imagine that creating some air spaces will change anything, but let's actually go and knock out a few of the shrubs and just try to ascertain if mobs are any more likely to spawn over in that area than anywhere else. But I don't think they are. Uh, it seems like nothing has really changed. I'll go ahead and also just to try to verify that. We'll go back into peaceful mode just to get rid of all of the hostile mobs and then we'll change things back to normal and just see if more of the hostile mobs spawn right around here. Nope, they're just spawning anywhere they want. And so I don't know what the new mob spawning algorithm is. I could definitely try to uh, do some of my own science to figure that out, but I think this will be a thing where I have to enlist some friends who are able to go take a look at the Minecraft source code in order to find things out because that'll be an easier way to get a more precise answer. Um, but this is a mob spawning change that I was not aware of uh, and I don't know that a lot of other people are aware of as well. So I just wanted to go ahead and show it off. And yeah, science. I hope you guys enjoy. Bye-bye.